I'm Helleth, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This week I'm talking about maternity wear. I think when it comes to maternity wear, the offering is not great. Um, there's some, you know, there's some great brands doing some great things. Seraphine are doing amazing things. Topshop is always great. Um, but there's also a lot of frumpiness going on in the market. So I think the thing being is, there is, I don't think you need to spend that much money on maternity wear because at the end of the day, it is, it is actually a small amount of time. However, I think there's key pieces that if you invest well in, they'll see you through um, and beyond. My first tip would be leggings. Buy a load of leggings. Good quality leggings is the answer. I'm really loving Seraphine for their leggings. Um, they're lovely. I've also got a really lovely pair of maternity le leggings here from Jojo Mum and Babe, which I've got. Maternity leggings means that you get this extra bit to support your bump. These ones are really soft, really nice and thick, stretchy. Um, really like these and I think they're £20 from Jojo Mum and Babe. Um, I've got a, I'm going to get a few of these just because I know what I'm like and when, I'm, when I get bigger, which I will, I tend to get very big, um, I... I will live in leggings, black leggings and sort of jumpers and, and various things. Um, I really like to do leggings, vest tops, so um, maternity vest tops and, and baggy shirts. Um, so anyway, so these are really beautiful leggings. Like I say, also Seraphine do beautiful leggings. Really, again, really soft. I'm definitely going to be getting some of those. Um, what, I, what I have got from Seraphine which, where are they, um, are amazing and super cool, are these leggings. Um, so, they are, I want to say leather, they're not leather, they're pleather. Um, but how cool is that? So, you know, you don't have to be from peer maternity. Um, so these are really cool. I really like that they're something a little bit different. So they'll be great. They're a little bit big for me at the minute, but obviously as I grow, they will fit. And I just think, especially around Christmas time, when you kind of, you're going out and you, you know, going out for dinners or whatever, and you want something a bit more, a bit more sort of stylish than just normal leggings, these will be great because they'll be comfortable and look cool. So I'll probably wear that with nice, nice big chunky jumper and some boots. They'll be cool, so I'm really, really pleased with that, with them. I mentioned this in my last video, uh, but I wanted to mention it again because I just think they're so cool. And it's it's these Love Your Bump belly belly belts, and they're here. These are great because they just mean that you can wear your jeans, normal, normal, everyday jeans for a little bit longer so you get a set in in the it, you get different size sets different fastenings as well so you get you get buttons and these little hook fastenings so depending on what, how, what your trousers or jeans are like and obviously as you grow you you go for the for the longer belts but what happens what you do with these is you put them on where you fasten your your jeans or your trousers and it just means that they will last a little bit longer. Um, these are great. I, I just think this this is such a genius idea because it just means you don't have to buy so many maternity jeans. And maternity jeans are not easy to find good maternity jeans. And it is such a small amount of time that you end up wearing them. So I think these are great. Really recommend these, love them. Um, however, having said that, I think it is invaluable to probably have a couple of maternity jeans because by the end you're gonna need them I mean you as much as and I do and I will live in my leggings there'll be certain occasions where you want to wear jeans and maternity jeans just give you that extra support that you need I have got um, a lovely black pair that I've got from from Jojo Mum and Babe or Baby how do you say that Jojo Mum and Babe Jojo Mum and Baby um yeah so this is this is what I'm talking about 
this is the extra support that you get so that covers your bump and you look like you're wearing jeans you are wearing jeans but you've just got that extra support gosh these look massive but i guess you do fit into them at that at that point so these are really soft as well really like this fabric really super soft denim so i will be wearing those in a few months time um let's see what else have i got i have got this is not maternity wear and this is this is kind of the other thing really look out for things that are not maternity wear but will see you through zara at the minute are doing really lovely knits and this is just a really flowy flowy jumper really nice soft material gorgeous in fact um really inexpensive i think this was this was 50.99 and it's flowy and it's long i've bought this in a large and i'm already wearing these and it they just really they're really comfortable and i know that they'll be able to wear these for a good few months probably not all the way through because where you get too big but um but certainly for the next few few months they will see me through and then also i'll have them for next year so it's about investing really i mean i know that this this will see me through um and like i say they're, they're really inexpensive at 15.99 so i've bought quite a few of these i've got one in gray and in navy and in black and in charcoal um but yeah such beautiful fabric really like those um what else have i got I do love a chunky knit this i got from it's a poncho what's a poncho yeah it is poncho from again from jojo mama baby nice big this will properly see me through the winter months um it's got pockets nice big neck i just think it's really chunky really gorgeous material and yeah looking forward to that wearing that and then the last thing this is a bit of a splurge but beautiful so nice a gorgeous gorgeous maternity jumper this is from isabella oliver which oh, they, they have the most beautiful things in isabella oliver i could could have spent a fortune but this is what i chose when i was on the website it's kind of it's a poncho come come um come jumper gorgeous material um will cover everything but it's got, it's a really light gorgeous soft material really really floaty and will see me through the whole pregnancy and beyond and to be honest I'm already wearing this now and you you know yes I have a little bump but not massive so I know that actually this is a jumper that even though it is maternity wear it isn't cheap so, but the quality is amazing and I know it, it'll be a jumper that I'll just carry on wearing probably for the next few years because it's just a beautiful lovely jumper really I love how it has so it has normal sleeve on this side and then it has kind of the the drapey kind of poncho-y sleeve on this side so you kind of wear it to one side and it's really cool really 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 pleased with that really like that so that's what i've got um i've also got the main actually do you know what my main tip it is is maternity vests i got some really lovely ones from asos cheap ones from asos last time which i've still got and i still wear um and i've got these um these are just super cheap from peacocks actually but great maternity basically they're really long vests that you just wear under anything so i've got a black one and i've got a white one so it just means that it covers everything so even if you're wearing your leggings covers that bit that needs to be covered if you know what i mean um and then you can you can wear shirts like this i mean this kind of shirt this is not a maternity shirt this is a shirt i've picked up from marks and spencers and yes for now i can do it up probably i'll be able to do it up for the next i don't know month or so and then you just wear them open you know i just think 
it's about kind of shopping smart. Yes, buy a few pieces that will cover up and see you through, but then also buy things like this that just that are just a little bit bigger, a bit baggy, because then you've got them for next year. You're not you're not buying just maternity clothes that once the maternity period is over, you're throwing away or you're selling. Although that is a good that is a tip. Is if you are investing and you think, gosh, I've I've invested too much don't worry because there's always always somebody else who's pregnant so there's always the opportunity to sell them on I've I that's what I've done in the past I've um, sold on my maternity clothes wish I hadn't now but hey ho um, yeah so so that's another tip um, so that's it that's what I've so far that's what I've got I can't imagine I'll get that much more stuff I think like I've mentioned, I will probably go back onto Seraphine and buy some more of their leggings, some more of their vests, maternity vests, because they look. I know that their that um, their quality is really lovely and really super soft. So um, I I really like their stuff. And that's it. That's probably what I will live in for the next few months. Um, and then just mix in bits and pieces that I've already got in my wardrobe. So cardigans, shirts. So that's what I've got. Um, if you have any questions, any um, any suggestions, any ideas, please do let me know and leave a comment underneath and I will have a read and respond. If you've enjoyed this video, please do subscribe. Subscribe to my channel, please, and also give me a thumbs up. That would be great. Um, all right, I will, um, I'll be back soon. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye.